Hey, what's up, guys? It's x 2 robby 2 x here, and I'm bringing you another Minecraft mod made easy. Now, I just spent about two hours trying to figure out uh, the summoning thing because my Earth Golem on my mod is kind of glitching out and doesn't spawn at some some places, and I, I cannot figure that out. So I'm gonna—I mean, I'm gonna do that during the weekend. But that's what this tutorial was gonna be about. But yeah, I can't figure it out. I don't want to just give out misinformation. So I'm gonna make a simple tutorial. It's just gonna be quick, quick, quick on how to add in-game messages. If you wanna, you know, if you wanna do something or whatever. If you wanna add an in-game message, sure, whatever. So because if we look at our entity player that Java, there's a method in here called public void add chat message. Now this will um pretty much show the chat message to the entity specified to the player entity specified so pretty much any method that has a entity player parameter you can use this on so I'm looking at my uh, item block human crossbow right now and on player stopped using has an entity player method so let's just go ahead and pop it in here so entity player dot uh, I already forgot what it was called. Add chat message. Add chat message. Now let's give it a parameter. Um, what happens when I shoot my crossbow? Um, boom, because it's a explosive crossbow. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, yep, that looks good. So let's go ahead and save that. Play it. Let's make a. Yeah, I was. Oh, there are a lot of. Uh, I'm gonna make a creative world because I don't feel like getting the necessary items for a crossbow. This might generate pretty slow because I have a lot of mods loaded in and whatnot. So I'm trying to figure those stupid spawns out. If everybody knows anything about spawns at 1.1.0, 1 .1 let me know because they're a lot different than. Uh, than pre 1.0. Um, let me make this bigger, and let me get a block and crossbow. And I think that's it. So let's go ahead and shoot. And we can see that on the in our chat box over there, we can see um, our little boom message. Now those stop like they disappear after a while, so. I would suggest not using it on a crossbow or any weapon or anything like that. Just because they can get really annoying. So use it on a method that um, does not involve... Whoa, that is a lot of blockium. Holy... Oh my god. Wow. Alright, yeah, so <laughs> sorry for that. I would suggest using it on a method that is... Um, that is uh, not as frequently used just so it doesn't spam your chat box but other than that I mean it works so sorry for the really short tutorial I spent a lot of time trying to figure out the spawning and summoning but I just can't get it right now I promise I'll spend a lot of time on it during the weekend so hopefully I'll have that out with my NPC tutorial so uh... yeah um, that, I mean, that's all I got so sorry for that uh, don't forget to like the video if you liked it. Uh, put your comments on in the comments, but put your uh, suggestions and errors if you have any on uh, inside my Minecraft forum post, which is going to be linked down in the description. And because I don't want to flood my you know my comments. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have questions, put them in there. I'll try to answer. I mean, I'll try to be on that forum post a lot. So. That's probably even better than reaching me on YouTube. And don't forget to use uh, code brackets if you're using code. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See ya!